Hello, I'm Crypto Diamond, and today's video is on Kronos. And the reason I'm making this video is because I keep seeing Kronos pop into my YouTube feed and gaining popularity, and I really wanted to know why Kronos is making a name for itself. So I decided to do some research to see what I could find, and I really loved what I found about this project, and I did pull up the white paper in the audit as well. So let's jump right on into it. So here's the homepage, Kronos.org, and the first thing you see is it's the first EVM compatible chain built on Cosmos, ushering the next billion users into DeFi, NFTs, and Web3 gaming. And those are some big pants to fill right there, but I do think they can do it from what I've read so far. And it is also open for anybody that wants to develop dApps as well. And if you want to go ahead and develop a dApp on Kronos, go ahead and get started right here on the homepage. They made it really easy for you to find. And it looks like they do offer up to $1 million in grants as well. So it lets you scale your project with easy portability and easy to use platform to rapidly port apps from Ethereum and EVM compatible chains. And like I said, with the funding, the Crow EVM fund grants up to 1 million US dollars per project as well. And a huge user base, access to a rapidly growing global user base of over 10 million users. So why Kronos? EVM compatible, built on Ethermint, which supports rapid porting of apps and smart contracts from Ethereum and other EVM compatible chains. It's scalable. Kronos can process more transactions per minute than Ethereum, making it faster, cheaper, and carbon neutral to ex execute smart contracts. It's interoperable. The Inter-Blockchain Communications IBC protocol enables interoperability and bridging to the Crypto.org chain and other IBC-enabled chains such as Cosmos Hub, Proof of Authority or POA, a more streamlined and scalable consensus mechanism, consensus protocol while still maintaining security with a range of validators that many different parties run, and it's also open source. We welcome our community to review and provide suggestions to strengthen Kronos. So it looks like it's really easy to get started on programming on Kronos as well. And the thing that caught my eye mostly was the games, but we're going to look at everything before we get to the game part as well. So you can go into the developer side right here and look into the faucets right there in the developer tab. And for those of you who don't know what faucets are, faucets usually help you get tokens on test set and stuff like that. Or just to get started in a project is what a faucet usually is. If you want to check out these faucets, the links are right there. As of right now, here's all the wallets supported by Kronos, which is a lot more than I expected, honestly. So you have Crypto.com, MetaMask, and Brave Wallet. Right there are just three huge wallets just off the bat, let alone all the other wallets they have in this list right here. So if you want to see any of the wallets that Kronos supports, just go to the homepage, click on the Wallets tab, and you can see all 12 wallets that Kronos currently supports. Then it also has validators as well, and it has plenty of validators going on too. If you guys want to look at all the different validators across the Kronos, and you can see all the different projects as well, which I was really surprised to see how many projects were on here. I'm not going to lie, because I just keep hitting load more, and it just keeps going. But it doesn't just tell you about the project, but it tells you if it's a DEX, a launchpad, a game, or what's going on. So it does categorize what each project is as well, and I really like that. And it has the homepage link and their Twitter account on each project too. In case you see a project you really like and you want to look more into it, Click on the home button right there and it takes you right to that project homepage so you can explore more about that project too. So I really love how Kronos has laid this out and made it easy to find all the resources you really want to look for in a project, including Beefy Finance. I've been seeing Beefy jump across a lot of projects, usually offering high APYs for a lot of crypto projects. Crypto.com, just a name known by almost everybody across the world. It's just a lot of things I'm seeing on here going a lot of great things, honestly. So I see Kronos, I can see why they're gaining popularity. I didn't realize this many people were already building on Kronos. So I do see this as a great investment for the end of 2022, the beginning of 2023 season. And there is the white paper. And let's go over the introduction of what Kronos is about. Kronos is a decentralized, open source, energy efficient public blockchain with high speed and low transaction fees. Kronos is designed to support the creator economy with Web3 applications such as DeFi and GameFi, ultimately serving as the foundational infrastructure for an open metaverse. Kronos is designed to serve the next billion Web3 users and help them experience the full promise of self-custody of their digital assets. Kronos is an Ethereum virtual machine or EVM compatible blockchain powered by Ethermint and built with the Cosmos SDK that supports inter-blockchain communication or IBC protocol. Accordingly, end users can import cryptocurrencies from Ethereum, Cosmos, and other chain families into Kronos and subsequently use, trade, or invest them in innovative smart contract-based protocols leveraging the rich application ecosystem of Ethereum, Solidity, and rapidly port apps and smart contracts from Ethereum and EVM compatible chains. So it sounds like it makes it a lot faster for developers to develop their apps and get them onto this chain 
from what I can read in the introduction. And everything you're going to want to read about Kronos is right here in the white paper, including the EVM compatibility, the scalability, the interoperability, and pretty much anything you want to find out about Kronos is going to be right here. I do love what I've seen in there so far, but let's pull up the audit as well. And here you go is the Kronos node audit. And they did score really great on their audit as well. As you can see, they did have some findings, but they are working to resolve these findings. And it's always around the same one that I could find a centralization as the major. And that's just common in most GameFi or anything that has NFTs. I've been noticing a centralization on there. I'm not saying it's bad. I don't know much about it, but it does look like they're working to resolve it. And from what I can see, the audit is great. And the current price why I'm making this video is up 7.6% today. Sitting a little over six cents, almost seven cents for a crow token. So it is really low as of right now. Um, it looks like it's down about 88% for the year. So it is at a low. I don't know if it can get lower. It possibly can, but this right now looks like a good entry point. And from what I can see, it has been making a name for itself and making waves all across crypto space. I don't know why. I never heard much about Kronos until the past couple weeks, but it has definitely been making a name for itself and been making a name super fast. And the one of the things that caught me is in the gaming part of it. So let's go back up here to play. So start building your game on Kronos today. Kronos Play is integrated with the C++ development and chain safe gaming SDKs with full support for two gaming engines. And get this, Unity and Unreal. So Unreal Gaming Engine is used in a lot of Xbox and PlayStation games such as like Gears of War, Call of Duty, and other games that have Unreal technology. So I do see the games graphically wise getting extreme especially if they're using unreal engine to help program some of these blockchain games and that really caught my eye because unreal engine is a huge huge thing i never thought i would see it in blockchain technology to so easily integrate your game on chronos with a few lines of code insightful on-chain data wallet authentication and authorization and transfer tokens and nfts directly into your game and that's one thing I like to see there is that you can transfer the tokens and NFTs directly into the game because that makes me think in the future they might be able to use this for console gaming as well. So that'd be kind of cool to see an Xbox or a PlayStation where you can actually play with NFTs in the games that you're playing on your console as well. So why build your games on Kronos? It's multi-platform support, so develop games on multiple engines such as Unity and Unreal. Scale up for adoption. Work alongside top blockchain starter, accelerator, and Kronos Labs. And you get global research. Get exposure to a rapidly growing and expanding community of 10 million plus users. Highly scalable in interoperability as we said before. And if you want to go into more of what the programming engines are, you can scroll down more here and see who the feature featured builders currently are in Kronos Play. And they already have, it looks like, about 10 people building games on here currently. If you guys have any more questions about Kronos, feel free to reach out to me on the Crypto Diamond Discord, the Crypto Diamond Telegram, or the Crypto Diamond Twitter. Hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day trading. Goodbye.